We bake a lot of cookies here in the Southern Living Test Kitchen, and one of my favorite decorating techniques is a wet-on-wet -wet icing technique. It makes a really beautiful cookie that is sure to make your cookies the talk of the town. So to do this technique, you want to take a cookie that has been cut out, baked, and cooled, and you want to put it on a sheet of parchment paper to catch any icing that may drip off of it. And the first thing we're going to do is flood the cookie with a royal icing that's a little bit of a looser consistency. This icing is made with two pounds of powdered sugar, four teaspoons of meringue powder, and three quarters of a cup of water. And you just mix that together so you have a nice smooth consistency, and then fill your piping bag, or a Ziploc bag will work too. And the first thing we're gonna do is pipe a ring of icing all around the edge of the cookie. Then when you get to the beginning where you started, just keep going in kind of a spiral pattern towards the center until you've covered the entire surface of the cookie. And now what we're gonna do is we're gonna take a toothpick and swirl it around in this frosting, starting all around the edge, just like we did when we were icing it, to make sure that the layer of frosting is smooth and even. Great, so now the fun part. Now we're gonna decorate it. So I have another color of icing, the same consistency as the first one, the same wet consistency, and we're just gonna pipe this in a design directly over the wet frosting that we just put on the cookie. And what you can see happens is the wet frosting kind of sinks into the layer of frosting that's already on the cookie, and it almost looks like we painted the cookie. Just for fun, let's do another color. And that's it, that's all there is to it. You wanna let this cookie sit for about an hour so the icing can dry, and then you can stack them and take them with you, or you can eat them at home.